If you've been playing badminton for a while, you definitely know this game. This is one of my favorite ones, the box game. So if you're looking for a next badminton racket, please visit our website www.basicfeather.com. The link is also in the description. The box game is without the front of the net and the back of the court. So it's the two fields at the center on a half court. The box game is a game which you can use for a warm-up exercise. You can also do it while you're practicing with a lot of pace. I believe it's super good to practice your racket skills and your fast movement, so your, your quick feet. That's a super good exercise because you don't need to consider the back of the court or the front of the court. So it's a lot of tiny movements with your feet and a lot of movements up here with your racket. So the half court box game can be played one against one, but it can actually be three persons as well. One is always sitting on the outside, sort of say, and then you play one rally, the loser goes out and the, the one sitting outside goes in again. You can also play it on a full court with four players in total where each one covers their own box game. If you want to win at the box game, it's a lot about getting the initiative. You would pretty quickly figure out if you're too defensive in a box game, you will lose because your opponent isn't covering a big court. So that means they can pretty easily make the kill with a big smash or at the net. Though so you need to get the initiative, I'd say, to be able to win a box game. So that gets back to having the quick feed. If you're not, again, you'll be in a defensive situation and then you'll probably lose. So even though the box game is, is two fields on the court, I'd say please remember to move outside the fields as well. So for example, getting close to the net, being able to do the net kill and do some pace changes, I'd say. Getting close to the net so you're able to, again, move up here with your racket and, and, and maybe even kill the rally. So please remember to keep your feet moving and don't be afraid to move close to the net as well. So in a box game, the court isn't too big, so it's a good time to play around with a different tactics or different movements. So let's say that I play a big smash, then I really try to rush to the net because what's the worst thing that could happen? Yes, they play the lift again, they do a long defensive shot, but again, the court isn't that big, so you, I guess you can cover it as well. So try and figure out some tactics or some movements that you can practice on a small court and then it's easy to move when you go to a standard normal court. So the box game, uh, we've been through it now. You've seen a few rallies on how to play the box game. It's just a fun game and it's really about enjoying badminton. We all love the sport. So play the box game, have fun, practice your racket action, practice your feet, practice your movement. You can do all that in just one game, this box game. Have fun. If you like the video and like our videos in general, I'd be extremely happy if you press the subscribe button, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Oh, 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 oh,